Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when audio is not working with Black Ops 7 game on your Windows computer. Now, the first step is to press Windows plus G to open a game bar. So on your keyboard, uh, you can press Windows plus G and this will open game bar. Now you can go to the speaker icon, click on it. And then over here, you can select your speaker. Make sure that you select your speaker, whichever speaker you, you want to use. Click on the drop down option and then select your speaker and make sure it is set to 100. Now scroll down over here, you will see the game. If the game is running, you will see Black Ops 7 game running over here. Make sure it is not on mute and it is set to 100. And you can even go to voice and make sure you, you select your microphone and your speaker over here and then relaunch the game and then check. Also make sure that you select the right audio device, make a right click on the speaker icon at the bottom right and then click on sound settings and make sure your speaker is selected over here and click on speaker icon and then go to volume mixture and over here if you see the game running, make sure it is not on mute and it is set to 100. Now still not working, the next step is to restart the game. Simply relaunch the game and then check if that does not work, restart your computer and then check. Next step is to set sound sample rate to 48,000 or 44,000 hertz in sound control panel. Now for this, uh, you can open control panel. So type in control panel in Windows search box and then click on control panel and go to hardware and sound and then click on sound over here. Now over here, select your speaker which you want to use and then make a right click, go to properties, go to advanced tab. Now over here, you can select 24 bit 48,000 hertz or maybe 16 bit 48,000 hertz. You can even try 24 bit 44,100 hertz, 16 bit 44,100 hertz. Now, whenever you make changes, make, make sure that you hit apply and then click on OK and then relaunch the game and then check. Uh, still not working. The next step is to, if you're playing with controller, disconnect the controller when you start the game. When you launch the game, disconnect the controller, connect the controller. Once, once you launch the game and once the sound is established, now you can connect the controller. Next step is to turn off spatial sound. Now for this, again, you can go to control panel, go to sound and then go select your speaker, make a right click and then go to properties, go to spatial sound. If this is set to Windows Sonic for headphones, you can select, uh, you can turn it off over here, select off and then you can check. If it is already off, you can try Windows Sonic for headphones and then make sure that you hit apply whenever you make changes and then click on OK and then relaunch the game and then check. Next step is to disable Oculus voice meter or any other audio device under, under recording and playback in sound control panel. Now for this, you can go to sound control panel once again and over here, sorry, click on sound over here and then make a right click on, uh, now over here, if under playback, if you see Oculus, voice meter or any other audio device over here, make a right click and disable it. Make sure you keep the speaker which you want to use, only that enable, rest you can disable. You can go to the, uh, do the same thing in recording. If you find Oculus, voice meter over here, make a right click and you can, you can just disable it. So select the microphone which you want to use, rest you can disable and then you can relaunch the game. You can do the same thing in device manager, make a right click on the start menu and then go to device manager. And then expand sound, video and game controllers. Now over here, if you find any other audio device like a coolers, voice meter, you can just make a right click and then click on disable. So in my case, this is the audio device which I'm using. If you have any third party audio device, any device which uh, audio device which you're not using, you can just make a right click and disable it. You can keep it. Uh, keep the speaker enabled which you want to use and then you relaunch the game and then check. Still not working. The next step is to uncheck hands-free telephony. Now for this you can type in run in Windows search box and then click on run box and then paste the command over here. The command is provided in the video description. Click on OK. You will see your speaker over here. Now make a right click on the speaker and then go to properties and then go to the services tab. Now in the services tab, if you find uh, right now uh, it's not connected my, uh, it's, so, services tab, once you make a right click and then you can go to properties and then go to the services tab. If you see hands-free telephony, you can uncheck hands-free telephony over here and then hit apply and then check. Now, once you're done playing the game, you can always uh, put a check if you want to. Now, the next step is to 
verify the game file so if uh, you can uh, verify the game file if you have the game on steam make a right click on the game select properties go to install files tab and then click on verify integrity game files once the verification is complete launch the game and then check if you have the game on battle.net you can click on this settings icon and then click on scan scan and repair and after the repair check and if you have the game on like xbox app you can click uh, on this three dots over here or you can make a right click and then click on manage over here and then go to files and then over here you will see verify and repair verify and repair and then you can launch the game so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to get the speaker working with the game so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel